Hi buddies, welcome back, it's Anne Sophie and today I have the Samsung Galaxy A34 5G and together we will go ahead and set it up and well, get started together. So this is the phone from the front and then this is it from the back. Um, we have the camera here and then we'll go ahead and press the power button. So we got welcome here and um, we can make emergency calls and go to the accessibility part, make some settings here and then we can go ahead and get started. We can select our language, let's say, where is it? Next and then for your review, check out the privacy policy to see how we manage your data. I agree to end user license agreement. I agree to the sending of diagnostic data. I agree to all. You don't have to agree to the sending of diagnostic data, um, but to the end user license thingy. Set up using another device to copy settings, accounts and more from another phone or tablet. Keep it nearby and unlocked. A Galaxy or Android device, iPhone or iPad. But you can also go ahead and skip this one. And then we can choose a Wi-Fi. You want to do that to like use the Play Store and stuff. I'm going to put in my password now. And now we can click on connect. Service provider setup. Your phone needs to restart to set up features and services from your device provider. Okay, restart. Copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google accounts and more. If you click on next, the phone will show you what you need to do next. Um, but you can also say don't copy. And then we'll go to the next step checking info sign in with your google account we want to sign in to our google account for using the play store and stuff if you don't have a google account you can click here on create one and i'm gonna put in my info now keep your account updated with this phone number if people like. who have your number will be able to connect with you across google services all right uh sure sounds good i'm in we publish the Google Terms of Service so that you know what to expect as you use our services by clicking I agree, you agree to these terms, so you can click on it, read through it. Um, also the Google Play Terms of Service and the privacy policy. You can say don't add this account now, but if you ever want to like add an account, you have to say oh, I agree. Did you know that your phone or tablet has settings and that you can change them now or later in settings? So how your phone or tablet uses location, how your phone or tablet can help make other phones and Google services better, and how to back up and restore data to Google. All right, got it. Um, then we have the services. So use basic device backup, use location, allow scanning, send usage and diagnostic data. If you turn off the location, the allow scanning will turn off automatically. This can only be turned on and off if the location is on. Um, and then you can click on accept. You can now choose your search engine. If you click on these little arrows here, um, it will show you more details about each search engine. Um, and you can also reconfigure that later again. I'm gonna go with the Cozio here and click on next. Protect your phone, prevent others from using this phone without your permission by activating device protection features. Skip this one because we're gonna have another video for that. Access your assistant with Hey Google. Ask questions, you can say I agree or skip. I'm gonna say skip here, skip. And getting your phone ready, this may take a few minutes again. Get recommended apps. Apps will be downloaded when you're connected to Wi-Fi. Apps from other companies, TikTok and Disney. I'm gonna like somehow not do it. Well, you can't really um, deinstall these here, so you need to click on next. Right. Samsung account, um, so you can put in your email or phone number here. Share files, uh, find your phone when it's lost or something. Um, we're gonna say skip now but you can totally go ahead, that sounds useful. 
Then we have Samsung services, we have continuity service, customization service, nearby device scanning. So you have more information here about each point and then you can say I agree. Now you can choose your display preference, so the dark theme or the light theme. I'm gonna go with the light theme. Um, this is what the dark theme would look like. Um, you can totally choose that. I'm gonna go with a light one and click on next. And now we'll all set up. You can say finish. Discover and install great apps. Press continue to discover great apps for your device. All apps are free. Um, no, I don't want that. Can we go like back? Ah, oh, we can say later, okay. Exit app setup. Are you sure you want to postpone setting up your new device apps? Yes. It looks like we can press yes because it's like gray um so that's a bit tricky there um but yeah so that was the setup we're now on our home screen uh, we have these three slides as usual um some pre-installed apps here and and then we can go ahead and insert like our sim card and all the other stuff so that was the initial setup of the Samsung Galaxy A33 5G. Hope you liked it, hope it helped. If so, thumbs up, share and subscribe and hope to see you next time. Bye.